Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. So, today I thought I'd give you a pregnancy update because it's been a while. I don't, I think the last one I wasn't even 30 weeks, I doubt I was. I am currently 36 weeks pregnant. I just had an appointment today that I will talk about here in a minute. But while I am giving you guys the updates, I might do a small little nursery tour. It's not completely ready yet, but it's getting there. Um, I'm going to be putting baby clothes on hangers. So I bought 110 hangers, so I'm hoping that's enough. Um, I decided to keep her newborn to nine months out, like the six to nine months. Um, as her biggest size and then I put the rest away in her closet until she gets to that because girls got a lot of clothes so I am currently putting all of these on hangers to put in her closet I'm almost done actually uh, I wouldn't say I'm almost done pretty close let me sh so those are three to six months these are, or sorry, these are three months. These are three to six months. And then I have a small pile here and up there. Those are um, her six to nine months. She doesn't have much six to nine months, but I mean, we definitely have plenty of time to still buy her some. Um, but yeah, so she has a ton, a ton of clothes. I just had my baby shower, I think it was two weekends ago, and it went really good. It was super cute. It was like floral and stuff like that because who doesn't like floral? It's all girly and stuff, so we did that, and it was really fun. I can post some pictures of us opening gifts. I didn't get many pictures um, of the actual like setup we had because I was really busy, but it was a great turnout. So, excuse me, I have like the hiccups. Um, what else? Um, yeah, so we're putting clothes on hangers. I'm gonna try to get my diaper bag together. Um, probably won't be in this video, but I will show you what will be in my hospital bag maybe, and the uh, diaper bag maybe in another video. But I know it's been forever. So update is, again, I'm 36 weeks pregnant as of Sunday. And I went to the doctor today. And I'm officially one centimeter dilated. And she said about 40% effaced and baby is head down. So that's really exciting because at my last ultrasound, um, at my 20 week ultrasound, baby was breech. I'm not really sure how they know by doing like the cervical check and feeling your stomach if baby is head down, but she said baby's head down, so I trust her. She's been doing this forever, so, um, so yeah, that's super exciting to know that we're progressing. Um, I haven't really been doing anything to like progress anything besides my normal daily activities. I still am working, um, and I will continue to work until I go into labor. So, pray for me, guys. It's, uh, it's really hard having to go to work every day. But, I get weekends off, so that's nice. It's just been really stressful trying to prepare everything, like, after work and on the weekends. Like, I just want to enjoy my weekends. I don't want to have to, like, clean and stuff, you know? But... Oh, I'm out of breath. Um, let's see. I will give you guys a bump update um, here in a little bit. Actually, I'll just post a picture because I have shorts on and my legs are really ugly because they're chubby from being pregnant. And I don't want to show my legs. So I'll show you guys a picture <laughs> of my updated bump pic. Look how cute these are. I love the ones, I heard to get the ones that zip, so my friend, that's where I got mainly like all of her clothes from, was my friend, because she just had um, two girls recently, she has a three year old and a one year old, so I got a ton, a ton of their clothes, which I am very thankful for, because, I mean they're basically new, because you know, babies get a ton of clothes and you 
They probably only wear them a few times, honestly, because they grow so quick. So, yeah, I have a ton of clothes. Look at this cute jacket we got when we went to the Toledo Zoo. We love the zoo. We have a membership, which actually expires on her due date. <laughs> um, but we got this cute jacket for when we go to the zoo. I'm super excited to take her to the zoo. Um, we have some plans that I don't know if we're going to do or not. Depending how the baby is and how I'm feeling. Um, Jeremy's work always has, they give us tickets or discounted tickets to go to Kings Island or I think it's, I don't think they've had Cedar Point, but it's usually Kings Island. Um, they give us, they rent the whole thing out for their employees and their family. So I might go to that cause I don't ride rides anyway. So it'd be just kind of nice to like walk her around and stuff, but it's also during the summer. So it just depends what the weather is like. If it's too hot, probably won't go. Um, I mean, yeah, it all just depends on that pretty much. Um, yeah, so that's pretty much all the updates. Nothing really new. I mean, I've still been trying to think of any symptoms that I've gotten, like new symptoms. Which I haven't gotten any new symptoms, so, except for, I don't know, I'm more tired. Like, I get more tired throughout the day. Um, oh, I didn't update you guys on this. Um, my iron, when I did the blood work for the glucose test, which I passed. I don't remember if I had a video on that either. I passed the glucose test at my 20... 28 week appointment is that when they do that um I passed it and then they also checked my iron and I have to take an iron pill every other day so that's fun um it's kind of annoying because it says to not take it with like calcium so like I can't have dairy like two hours before or one hour after or something like that I mean I can it will just the iron won't be as effective as it, sh like it can be. So, I take that every other day. Um, and it's always the days that I'm craving, like, ice cream or something. Because it's always, I always take it at 8 o'clock. And that's usually, like, when I'm trying, starting to get, like, snackish. And I want something to snack on. But, it's okay. Sometimes I don't always not have the dairy. But, well, I don't have many more hangers. I'll, I'll probably have to go back and get... So, at Walmart, they have these. It's a pack of 10 for like $1.57. Not really sure if that's a good deal or not, but I bought a whole box, and there was like 11 of these in here. So, I had 110 hangers, and we're almost done with our clothes. I still have this tiny pile and the tiny pile on my chair. So, I'm trying to hurry because I want to be done doing this. Uh, um, oh yeah, so nesting, I don't know if, I don't know if I'm nesting because I feel like, I mean I am and I'm not, like if I didn't have to do this stuff, I wouldn't want to do it, you know, is that weird, like, I don't know, I just feel like, I feel like nesting, you're like, I want to do this, I want to clean, blah, blah, blah. I mean, I want to have my house organized and, like, put together and stuff, but I don't want to do it. If I could pay someone to do all this for me, I would. Maybe. I don't know. I kind of like looking at her clothes and being in her nursery, so I don't know. I don't know if it's nesting or not. You tell me, but these last few, I don't even know, this last week, I have been very emotional, like, not just because I'm about to have a baby, like, I'm not all, like, sappy about that, I mean, I'm super excited, and, like, it is emotional to think about that I'm gonna have a baby, or we're gonna have a baby in, like, less than four weeks, 
but sometimes I'll just cry because I feel like crying like over nothing or like everything will make me cry I'll either cry over nothing or every little thing will make me cry like the other day I cried because I dropped my phone like nothing was going my way at least I thought um feel bad for Jeremy because I've been grumpy and yeah just all the emotions and feelings but he's he's been taking a while he's been doing really good um he he doesn't get upset with me because I'm upset you know because it's hard it's hard but he's been doing a lot around the house helping so I do appreciate my husband he's the best ever um very very supportive and very thankful for that um I think that's basically like all of the updates I have um yeah someone commented and wanted an update yeah I don't have any new symptoms that's what they asked is if I had any new or um if any symptoms went away stuff like that he's basically still all the same just get more tired easily I'm very emotional my hormones are everywhere but you know that's normal um especially nearing the end four weeks or less and that is absolutely crazy to think that she's going to be here in four weeks or less because I still have a ton to do still a ton to do but that's okay we will get there um yeah so that is the update if you guys have any questions let me know put them in the comments down below um and yeah thank you guys for watching I've been out of breath this whole time sorry it hasn't been like a planned out video I just kind of was like I'm gonna turn the camera on and we're just gonna talk pregnancy but yeah thank you guys for watching and I love you guys so much in the next video I will do a, a nursery tour I decided right now I'm gonna wait because it's kind of cluttered there's trash in here still from like opening everything so I'll wait till it's all together and then I will show you guys that I'll do a hospital bag and diaper bag tour thing of what I'm putting in it. Yeah, so I hope to see you guys in my next one. Bye!